only able to find five instances where a single soldier took on a tank. And four of those five, those men, very deservedly, are holding the Medal of Honor. The story of a Wisconsin veteran has some hoping he'll be awarded the highest military honor. He's an American hero born and raised right here in Northeast Wisconsin. That's right. 96-year-old James Majellis of Fond du Lac now lives in Texas. His actions in World War II have a group of a hundred of peop hundreds of people and a local congressman pushing for Congress to award Majellis the Medal of Honor. Fox 11's Chad Doran explains. In a snowy field in a small town in Belgium in 1945, during the famous Battle of the Bulge in World War II, First Lieutenant James Majellis of Fond du Lac did something extraordinary. All of a sudden, out of the city comes the Mark V tank. I got close enough where I could hit it broadside, spun it around, disabled it, and when the tour was open, I charged over there and was able to drop a hand grenade in it. That eliminated the tank. In action for which he was awarded the Silver Star. The 96-year-old retired from the Army in 1962 as a lieutenant colonel. Majellis now lives in Texas, but some in his hometown want to see his medal upgraded to the highest military award. I was only able to find five instances where a single soldier took on a tank, and four of those five, those men, very deservedly, are holding the Medal of Honor. Jim Majellis is the only one that is not Jim Newman and about 300 other friends and family of Magellus have created t-shirts and a website to spread the word. They hope to have one million names on a petition to Congress for Magellus to be awarded the Medal of Honor. Congressman Tom Petri, a Republican from Fond du Lac, is also aiding in the effort, introducing legislation on Magellus' behalf. The Belgian government, a number of other European governments have given him uh, special awards and we'd like to do it the same. Magella says he appreciates the attention and efforts to get him the medal. And he says if it is awarded to him, it's an honor he'll share with many people. He recognizes your buddies with you. It's to his unit, the men who fought with him. It's to his company, to the 82nd Airborne Division. Then beyond that, it's a recognition of your family in your hometown, Fond du Lac, in Wisconsin. Magellus is the most decorated soldier in the 82nd Airborne Division's history. There's also a documentary about his career in the military. The only thing missing is the award many feel he deserves. Anything that hits Congress is an uphill battle, and uh, this certainly should draw bipartisan support. For a native son who saw more than his share of battles. In Fond du Lac, Chad Doran, Fox 11 News. If you'd like to read more about Magellus and his story, we have a link to the website on our homepage. Just go to fox11online.com and click on the News Links section.